Welcome to Magical Women. I'm Connie Boyd. Today we are anxiously watching Helen Coughlin on Penn and Teller Fool Us Season 9 to see if she will fool the duo for a record fifth Fool Us trophy. Go, Helen! Welcome back. I don't want to see our next magician. I need to see our next magician. And here they are. Pen and Teller, it's all your fault. Since we've been on Fuller, so many wonderful things have happened. Australian TV just did a documentary on Dad's life. And last year, I did a six-week stint performing Dad's Magic at the Sydney Opera House. They introduced me as the woman who fooled Pen and Teller four times. Like this time, you take that right out the other end, and this time, there was this one. Thunder from down under! And boys, I know you loved last time. This show is like family to us now. Here's the thing though, boys. In our family, we're pretty competitive. Dad spent a year creating the routine I'm going to do for you tonight. And I have to admit, I feel the pressure a little more each time I come on. There's more to lose and more to prove. It's toe-to-toe -to -toe once again, and I know we wouldn't have it any other way. Welcome to the family, boys. Back with more thunder from down under, here's four-time fooler, Helen Coughlin. Hello, Penn, hello, Teller. I am so excited to be back in Las Vegas with you. For my fifth appearance on Fool Us, I've decided to take things full circle. First time I was here, I fooled you with a milk trick. Tonight, I'm going to show you some tricks with milk again. And you'll notice I said tricks. One is with this glass, and you can see in there, and of course, some milk. Now, this might look like the trick that fooled you first time out, but I promise you it is completely different. And in fact, I might actually save that one for last. Now, you know when I come on the show, I like to change the rules a bit. Tonight's no different. I'm going to show you two tricks. So let's agree that if either one of these tricks fools you, I win. That's fair enough. I'll take that as a yes. <laughs> with, with this trick, I'm actually going to give you a heads up and let you know that what you're about to see isn't actually happening. It's not going to happen. Let me show you. I have a pail of milk and a jug. I'll pour the milk from the pail into the jug. And you can see it going in there, going all the way into the jug. But like I said, that didn't actually happen. No. Nope. I'm going to reverse it for you and pour it back from the jug into the pail. It looks good, doesn't it? But like I've said, that didn't actually happen. Now, you might be sitting there thinking, well, why didn't that happen? I tell you why, because it's this jug. It doesn't hold any liquid. It can't possibly. It doesn't have a bottom in it. Thank you for that applause. Now, did that fool you? Because if it did, I'll finish now and I can save that for next season. <laughs> Actually, don't answer because while I'm here, I will show you this one. This is even more impossible than that. I'll actually fill it so you can see there is milk all the way up to the top. Put the back door in place, followed by the front door. Now, if I told you I could take a solid rod and push it all the way through a glass of milk, you might think that was impossible. But like I've proven before, sometimes with magic, the impossible is actually possible. You can see the rod all the way through. I'll remove the front door, followed by the back door, and boys, all I can say is cheers. Helen Coughlin! Oh, it's nice to be back. It's very nice to have you. I love how upset they get. You've already pulled them four. 
five times. I know. I'm, I'm still uh, baffled by that. It's yeah. so brave of you to just keep coming. You know what? There's more pressure on me. I mean, after the third and fourth, it's like, this is getting serious now. <laughs> I'm getting nervous when I come out now. Oh, Why was it easy the first time? I don't know. I had nothing to prove. It was just a bit of fun. Um, and when I did fool them, then it was, as I said, it was a bit of a challenge. And then, of course, because everything I do is, is Dad's creation, um, I must admit, after this one, it's like, Dad, can you give it a break? <laughs> but no, he's all already looking ahead. Oh, Okay, Helen, let's see if your milk trick baffled the boys again. Hello, Helen. Hello, Penn. We, uh, we sure love having you on the show. And I love we, being here. We sure love you, and we, um, we, sure love, uh, we sure love your dad. He's amazing. But I do want to say, as much as we love you, mm -hmm. this show is called Penn and Teller Fool Us. It is not called Helen Coughlin Fool Us, which means if there's rules to be made, they're going to be made by us. Maybe and can we change the name of the show? Is it too us, Once you've done that, once you've done that, you can make your rules. But you don't get to make your own damn rules. As a matter of fact, when you said, can we agree if one fools you, we're going to give you the trophy? No, we did not say okay. You just said, I'll take that as good. You have brought out two tricks, and if we can bust one of them, you do not get a trophy. We're not going to bring down a half a trophy. There's none of that jive. We're not going to do that because it's not your show. It's our <laughs> show. Is that clear now? Is Hang that on. clear? Uh, I, yeah, okay, yeah. it's ours. Next so year, it'll you be do Helen not Coke. get to write the rules. We get to write the rules and both tricks have to fool us and they did. <gasps> <gasps> was fantastic magic and a clever tribute to Helen's first win with the milk penetration theme. Congratulations to Helen and her inventor dad, Arthur Coughlin. If you haven't watched and enjoyed our interviews and features with Helen Coughlin, please do so. She is a truly magical woman and we are thrilled to include her onto our Magical Women channel. Magical women are thrilled to include the best in entertainment diversity, past and present. Let us know your favorites and what you'd like to see more of, and we will try to include more of that content. I'm Connie Boy. Ciao for now.